Mark Payton once again proven he is one of, if not the best player in America. Eat your burger, eat some ribs, drink a cold one, not if you're that young, of course. Just have some fun because we got Texas opening up a three-game series with the Baylor Bears, and they open up getting out to a 2-0 lead as Texas scores on the wild pitch. They jumped out early on the wild pitch. They got two. You would think that would be enough for Parker French on the mound. Uh, especially when you consider this was a Texas team 14-2 and and scoring first in games. Fourth inning, what happens there with Colin Shaw? Don't see that too often. Took his eye off it just slightly. And then you have Duncan Wendell going up the middle. That one get past Brooks Marlowe, but Brooks had a fantastic game. So the situation starts to mount against the ace, Parker French. Skip goes out for a chat. Did the chat work? Ah, well, it did, because you got a double play. They score a run, but a crucial double play in that situation. Yeah, you want to you want to get a ground ball. Parker French is good at that. Gets the breaking ball over, 6-4-3. Gives up the run for the double play. Still 2-1 Texas. We go to the fifth. Lawton Langford. Plenty of vacancy out there in right center. Logan Brown comes around the score, and we are tied at two. Momentum going in the direction immediately of the Baylor Bears. Same inning, two outs, and Adam Toth, the RBI single, and Baylor with the lead. Baylor's going to take the lead right there, three to two. Definitely, definitely the momentum has shifted in this ballgame. Baylor would try to get more. You see? They would get, no, they would not, because that's Mark Payton playing in center field. You don't test his arm. Why would you do such a thing, Greg? I, I wouldn't. It's Mark Payton we're talking about. He always does that. I'm excited because this was an exciting game. Sixth inning, this was kind of summing up the night for Parker French. Did not look like him. Usually very good off the bump defensively. Gets off the mound very well. That one just kind of, you see him pat himself right there. My like bad. Physical. My bad, bad. Bad throw to first. So now you got two on, Chad Hollingsworth comes in, and you like the play by young Zane Gerwitz. Hey, that's, that's one you can hang a star on. That's a big mo momentum shifter in the ball game right there. Zane Gerwitz, a tough play turning two. You yeah, need to get some runs. Ben Johnson doesn't help the cause. Lose it in the lights right there. Yeah, you can see in the slow motion replay, he closed his eyes right before the ball got to him. That ball definitely got in the lights. Gets around there for a leadoff triple. Yeah, just keep in mind though, this would just build up the drama that we would see unfold in the bottom of the ninth because Eric Dodson comes around to score and Baylor takes the 4-2 lead. 69 straight games. Mark Payton has reached base safely. He had not until this swing of the bat. Going opposite field, just put it out there, Greg, and run like heck. You brought up the point though, 3-2 count. Brooks Marlowe is running from first, and he's safe. Everybody knew it. Mark Payton knew it as soon as, as soon as it was hit off the bat, getting fired up. That's good to see right there for the Texas Longhorns. 